Amen. We thank God for that song. We are praying. We are praying. Everyone, let's pray. Father, we come unto you this morning. We thank you, Father, for taking care of us the whole week. Now, as we're going to discuss about our health, Lord, may you take care of us because all of us need to be health. This is in the name of Jesus we pray and trust. Happy Sabbath. My name is Zipporah Kerandi. I thank God for all of you are here and all of you are listening to me and watching me. Today I'm going to talk about autoimmune diseases. This, this is a disease which is, these are diseases which are normally forgotten that they are there, but they are there. First of all, maybe we can ask ourselves, what is autoimmune disease? Just imagine when the body can start fighting you when it's supposed to protect you. That is autoimmune. Autoimmune is when the body is fighting you when it's supposed to protect you. And we have so many autoimmune diseases which I countless over 90. I'll just mention few like uh, which one? Systemic lupus erythromatosus, SLE, that is lupus. We have rheumatoid arthritis. We have Hashimoto's. We have um, we have sickle cell anemia. We have multiple sclerosis, and we have as many as. I, I can say, I'm just alighting them because there are so many. And causes, who caused this? Causes are not found. We don't know what causes this, but it's still in the process. But the body is not able to protect the parasites, the bacteria, the viruses, which comes to your body. It just fights you and your immunity comes low. So we are talking about when the immunity is very low. The body is inverted and the immunity is very low. Diagnosis of these diseases is, okay, first of all, let me talk about what are the symptoms of uh, this disease. It is not a disease, these diseases, because I have not seen, brought one disease which I'm talking about. I'm talking about the broad sickness. Diagnosis of them is fatigue, being tired, rashes in the body, nausea, headache, dizziness, and many more, joint pains all over the body. Those are the things maybe you can present to the health practitioner. But I might talk maybe one, which I'm so conversant about it, and uh, I might mention more about arthritis, lupus, and MS, multiple sclerosis. These diseases might be expensive for patients. You can imagine you have money, but if you are told you have this autoimmune disease, you don't have money because every other day you are using money. So, uh, diagnosis of these diseases, more especially if you face a rheumatologist, uh, a dermatologist, a neurologist, the basic test the doctor will request is full hemogram, full blood count, that is, and he will request ESR for immunity, and he will request ANA, that is anti-nuclear antibody, this is the basic one. And then he can request or she can request thyroid function test, more especially if it is endocrine inside. But the tests are so many and they're very expensive. I could encourage anyone who is following on this and you have some symptoms which I'm presenting 
within you, please feel free to see a medical practitioner who is near you or come to our, I can say, those ones who are in Kenya, you can visit your uh, provincial, uh, provincial hospital or our national hospital in Kenya, Kenyatta Hospital. We have a very senior the, uh, rheumatologist there and it, ha it happens to be our, our elder. I think you can be assisted. If you have that, you can call our line in church, then they can tell you where to go. Then you may need an x-ray, that is MRI, which is a bit, it will be more specific to say what you are suffering from. But be careful, don't, don't find yourself at home seated that I'm sick, you will just sleep at home, seek medical advice. Go to the hospital, you'll be assisted. You'll be sleeping at home without knowing what you are suffering from because this disease, diseases normally uh, create inflammatory in your body. Pain in your body, total pain you will have. Um, just saying, maybe even anemia can cause pain in your body, and, and other diseases, but it is better if you come to the hospital, you see the doctor, the doctor will see other tests which you will need. We thank God because we have medical practitioners in our church who can help you and who will help you so far, you'll be okay. If you are told this, this diseases, imagine, will you be healed? No. It's only management. You have to manage the disease. And in every disease, any disease invading you, most of them is management. It's not a dead sentence when you are told that you have lupus, when you are told that you have arthritis, when you are told that you have sickle cell anemia, when you are told that you have multiple sclerosis. It's only management. Even though the drugs and... Uh, the tests which are needed, they are very expensive. You need to see the doctor, and then the doctor will see what to help you with. It, it can take you so long to be discovered what you are suffering from. If you are at home feeling the way I've said, please seek a medical advice, which is very important. I'm imagining... It's, it's, I, I can be, maybe, I'm a patient of one of those diseases. It took, so, it took me so long to discover. I went to all the medical practitioners, many, many professors. You see, I'm spending money. I'm imagining somebody else might be spending money somewhere. Please go to any doctor who is nearer you. That doctor will explain to you where to go. By the end of the day, you'll be discovered what you are suffering from. And then, we have so many support groups. We have support groups for lupus. We have support groups for multiple sclerosis. We have support group for people who are suffering in anemia. These groups will assist you so that you'll never see yourself that you are alone. You are not alone. At least this, this group will support you. I pray that whatever which I've said is just little. We are going to record this then the church will have a look of this and then you can find yourself where, what you are suffering from and you will get the right doctor who is going to attend you. Thank you. May God bless you as we continue this Sabbath and majorly Maybe I can stress the point. Most of autoimmune diseases, they, are affect, they, they normally affect women. Women, me, today is a, a, a women day, women's day, Advanced Women Day. So you can imagine all the women, some of them, few women might be suffering from these diseases. So just check 
a medical advice which we'll need, and then you'll be helped. Amen? Thank you for listening to me. May God bless you.